always liked painting. I was painting from the little child, always. Uh, then I saw graffiti for the first time. It was somewhere in Germany. I absolutely loved it, tried it and become addicted doing this for many years. But then I realized uh, you can do graffiti in uh, winter, you know, it's cold outside. And there are always some problems with graffiti, you know, police and so on. So I decided to uh, try airbrush and it was for me allowed at the first sight. Uh, then I realized the airbrush can be much better for me because you can do it at home. Also you can make some money from it. Okay, there is uh, air which is pushing the color out from spray can or from airbrush gun. So the technique is similar but airbrush is like a macro photo. You can do crazy little details with the airbrush. Another thing, uh, when you use transparent colors with the airbrush, you can do fade outs which are very realistic. Uh, most of my clients are uh, guys who ride bikes, motorcycles. You know, they always give me words and I paint it. But it's not about expressing something from me because I don't know he wants his son to be on a helmet or things like this. Then a uh, second group is uh, the owners of restaurants or clubs where I do some on wall paintings. With this little helmet it's much more work than with big wall painting. When I go out and do graffiti, I mostly do characters like faces and I'm trying to express uh, things through the, their mimic. One of my ex-girlfriend told me when I go out and paint uh, something just for me, it's always very dark, like horror pictures and I don't know why but I want to uh, paint an airplane. I already get a customer who wants this for me, but I have to uh, wait until the spring because we will not do it in winter. So that's the big thing I'm waiting for.